Uh, so welcome again as we check uh, some few examples that involves the laws of uh, indices. So we check the first example. So that is 2 uh, to the power negative 4 times 3 to the power 2 times 5 to the power negative 3 divided by 2 to the power 3 times 3 to the power 4 times 5 to the power of negative, negative 2. So let's check the, the solution of that. <coughs> so you have numbers, and uh, we can see we have numbers that look alike. We have a two, we have a two, we have a three, and you also uh, have a five. So in this case here, we can uh, we can first of all just put the numbers that look alike together. So we have two negative four. Uh, then you can put this by two or three, then times. 3 or 2 and 3 or 4 then times 5 negative 3 and 5 negative 2. So these numbers are all one and the same thing. So when you write this uh, this way and this way, as long as they are they are joined together with a the multiplication, then they mean one and the same thing. So now you can use the laws of uh, indices to evaluate uh, these numbers because you can see the base is the same. So we can apply the quotient rule. And uh, the question rule states, if you have a number a n divided by uh, divided by a n, then this is just the same as saying a. You subtract the powers or you subtract the index or the indices that you have there. <coughs> so in our first case, we shall have two negative four minus three. So this fraction here uh, simplifies to become this. Then times 3, 2, then subtract 4, then times 5, negative 3, minus, then minus 2. So this uh, simplifies to this, this fraction uh, simplifies to this, then this one, uh, this one simplifies to this. So therefore, we have, <coughs> so minus 3, uh, minus 4 minus 3 is minus 7, so 2 minus 7 times. 2 minus 4 is minus 2, so 3 minus 2, then times, uh, this is minus 3, minus minus gives you a positive, so we have negative 3 plus 2, which gives us negative 1, so 5, negative 1, therefore, uh, in simplification, then this number simplifies to this, but we know, we can, if we want to leave our indices in positive, uh, as positive indices, then we can write this by knowing the rule of the negative index. We say it, if a number has a negative index, then it's supposed to be the denominator. It's supposed to be an inverse, but you change uh, the reciprocal, but you change now the power to become positive. The same with this and the same with that. So this one basically simplifies to become 1 over 2 to power 7 times 1 over 3 to power 2 times 1 uh, 5. One. And a number to power 1 is the same same number. So you multiply a number to power 1, then it just gives you the same number. So that is the solution to the first example. <coughs>